Ahead of Prime Minister Modi's arrival in Paris, the Defence Acquisition Committee clears the process for India to acquire an extra 26 Rafale jets and three Scorpion submarines. Now the price negotiations will follow. Let's go across to Vishnu, who joins us uh, from Paris. And Vishnu, now tell us what is the process here and uh, also uh, preparations as uh, the Indian Prime Minister will be arriving shortly. That's right. In about half an hour from now, Prime Minister Narendra Modi will be arriving in, uh, in France at uh, the Orly Airport. He is the chief guest uh, on Bastille Day. That's the French National Day and that is tomorrow. Ahead of that and in an expected move, the Defence Acquisition Committee of the government has cleared the process for India to acquire 26 additional Rafale fighters, this time for the Indian Navy, and also very significantly, in fact as significantly, three uh, Scorpion class French design submarines. India already operates six of these submarines, all built to a French design at Masgaon docks. The Navy has wanted more and it seems now that that process will also happen. I would uh, you know, like to stress that this is a process. It's not a done deal until the final contract is started. But the fact that India is announcing this, that they are in talks with France, it seems to indicate that this is a process that will go through. However, it will not be immediate. There will be contract negotiations which will take place. That could take months. It took several months before the last Rafale contract took place. So it is quite possible that the actual siding, uh, which will be cleared by the Cabinet Committee on Security, ultimately uh, would happen once a new government comes to power uh, after the election. So that's the time frame we are looking at. But I think the fact that the Defence Acquisition Committee has cleared this is because they have a ballpark figure that they're looking at. So they're well aware of, of their negotiating position by now when contract negotiations actually start. These are all very important steps for India and, and, our, and our Air Force, our Navy and our armed forces. So be that as it may, I think the big focus, of course, is Bastille Day. Uh, I'm at Place de la Concorde. It's uh, one of the areas close to which soldiers will be marching. We've got more than 200 Indian soldiers over here, tri-services, the army represented by the Rajputana Rifles and the Punjab Regiment. Uh, there's a Navy contingent, there's an Air Force contingent overhead. They're going to be Rafale fighters of the Indian Navy. And if you just look um, to the right, to my left, in fact, over here, you can see one of the stands which has uh, been set up where people will be seated. And uh, this is at Place de la Concorde, and there are going to be soldiers marching in this area as well tomorrow. So there is a great sense of excitement uh, ahead of uh, Bastille Day, uh, as you would expect. Uh, but for India and France, it is a very, very important uh, visit of the Prime Minister, which takes that strategic relationship between Paris and New Delhi forward. Right. And Vishnu, very briefly, uh, what else is planned? Uh, usually the Prime Minister, you know, has an event with the Indian diaspora. If you could tell us a bit about what is his program for today. Well, Gargi, as we know, it is a bit of a rock star event. I mean, that's what uh, uh, Narendra Modi commands whenever he goes and reaches out to the diaspora, whenever he speaks. So there will be a diaspora event later uh, this evening. We hope to be there as well. Uh, where, you know, the embassy and local communities of, of Indians have gotten together. They'll be greeting the Prime Minister. The Prime Minister often makes it a point to tell the diaspora that they are ambassadors of India. He also makes it a point that the, these are individuals who actually contribute to India's economic growth as well. So it is going to be yet another opportunity for that to take place later on today. Uh, before that, there will be bilateral talks which takes place. The, the, the head of the French Senate will be meeting uh, Prime Minister Modi, the Prime Minister of France will be meeting Prime Minister Modi, and then later on uh, in the evening, after bilateral talks, there'll be uh, a dinner which takes place. Uh, France's President Macron will be having that dinner with uh, Prime Minister Modi, the first among, I believe, two. Uh, and so there is that personal equation, of course, between the two leaders, uh, which should be reinforced by this visit.